compared to two of the 19s. Now, if data is presented in a frequency table, in order to calculate the mean, we have to do a different operation, but it's based on the same principle. It's the equal distribution of the total. But first of all, let's understand what this table means. Uh, let's say that some young men were and women were interviewed and asked about the age when they got their first job and the data is summarized in a frequency table. This means that five people said that they started working at age 16. Eight people said that their first job was obtained when they were 17. So basically, there are five 16s, eight 17s, and 15 18s, and so on. The, the, the mean in this case is calculated by finding the sum of the ages. So 5 16 is obtained by 5 times 16. And the ages of those people is 8 times 17, and so on. The sum of the frequencies is the sum of the people who responded. So this mean can be calculated by 5 times 16 plus 8 times 17 plus you continue this process until you get to 9 times 21 and this is divided by the sum of the frequencies which is 5 plus 8 plus etc until you get to the 9 and this approximately equals 18.77 years Now, for the median, the same process occurs. In this case, n is the sum of the frequencies. And if you add up the frequencies, you find that they are equal to 69. So, the median is at 69 plus 1 over 2 which is 35. So it's the 35th value. So we start counting. We have 5 plus 8, we have 13. Plus 15, we have 28. We haven't reached the 35 yet. Plus 20, and we have overshot 35. So the 35th point is somewhere amongst those 20 readings of 19 and we really don't care which one it is because they are all 19s so the median is 19. now let's consider the quartiles There are 69 data points, one of which was the median. That leaves us with 68. That means that there are 34 points below the median and 34 points above the median. So for the lower quartile, we, can, we pretend that we are finding the median of 34 points. So 34 plus 1 over 2 gives me 17.5. So I want to find the 17th and the 18th entries. Again, 5 and 8, that's 13. 13 plus 15 is 28. And I have realized that the 17th and the 18th points are here in this, in this entry. So the value of the lower quartile equals 18. 
and if we count down and we want to reach um, a value between the 17th and the 18th point from the top 9 plus 12 is 21 so 9 is not enough 20, 21 overshoots the 17th and 18th values so we know that the upper quartile is equal to 20 as well that's what we've done the mode here is very easy to calculate actually it doesn't require calculation the highest frequency is the 20 so the age that was most repeated was 19 so the mode is simply written down as 19 so this is a an introduction to uh, the uh, summary statistics the measures of location the mean the median and the mode in the case where you have the data as individual data points or when the data is presented in a frequency table. We'll discuss more in class.